what is good guys and welcome back you guys are seeing the team that we are about to take on and yes it's the best team in the nba am i nervous yes am i scared definitely but i'm going to get ready for this i'm going to play my heart out i'm gonna have the best game of my season so far we've only played three games so this will be our fourth so this could mean we could go four and no if we beat the defending champions if we can beat one of the best teams, one of the best dynasty teams right now. So, let, let's see what we could do going into this game. Now, before we jump into it, we got some things to go over. One, you guys have seen right here, they're talking good about me. I don't know what happened to the rookie, but in the last few games, he's been turning up. He's been making shots, and his court awareness is razor sharp. I've been doing my thing, and right now, I am the rookie to watch. I am leading the rookie of the year uh, conversation, and that's a good thing. You guys are seeing ESPN, Stephen A. Smith. All these people are talking about me, and I got to keep that buzz going. I got to keep my name relevant, and obviously, I don't want individual stats. I don't care about that, but if I can get that on top of what I'm doing, what, and if I can get that on top of my team cooking, I'll be happy with that. You guys are seeing some stats. I'm averaging 19.3 points a game, 3.3 boards, and 6 assists. I want to raise my points to about 25+. plus. I like my assists around 6. I want my rebounds around 5 to 6 as well. If I could get a triple-double, an average triple-double, that would be cool. But I wouldn't mind getting around 25 plus points a game, 5 plus assists, 5 plus rebounds. That would be my goal. And you guys are seeing right here the team to beat the Golden State Warriors. You guys are seeing. They are 2-1, and one and they have a stacked lineup, of course, Clay, Draymond, Curry, KD, and the new addition, DeMarcus Cousins. But you guys are seeing our big three, and I think that we have what it takes today to potentially get a dub. All right, so we're gonna go and try to get the tip off today, and we do win the tip. You guys are seeing Jackson kicks the ball out to me, and I am trying to do whatever, but we gotta swing the ball around, and we're gonna go. Blake Griffin with a pick. Blake Griffin, he backs up, and that is a steal by Curry. He's moving. KD's wide open, and he takes a three, and it's good. I need to play better defense. Once again, you guys are seeing. I'm trying to go to the rack, but I'm getting locked up by Kevin Durant. Three ball, and that is Bullock. Bullock is a three-point sniper for our team, and he's been making literally every three he takes. To the rack, I go, and you guys are seeing. Oh, I get blocked. Not a good attempt right there. There goes KD, coast to coast. He said, get out the way. Move. He's averaging about 21 points a game, shooting 52% from the floor. And he did knock down the free throw. Okay. 8-3 to three is the score. I have the ball, pick and roll. And Blake, roll to the basket. And a good finish by Blake Griffin. He's going to have to have a monster game today, and we know he can do that. Andre Drummond as well. But there goes Curry with the typical layup, left-footed, right-handed, going left, baseline off the glass. You have to have a soft touch to do that. All right. You guys are seeing now. I'm trying to get involved. I'm trying to attack the basket, but I'm getting locked up. Once again, pick and roll. Drumming, where you at? Drumming, where you at? And to the rack, I go a big right-handed slam. And just like that, I get my first two points on the day. KD, once again, is playing very good defense. But I get around him and another dunk. 
I'm like, you know what? KD, you're stepping up. I got to step up as well. 28 to 20 is the score, and we are down by eight in this second quarter. Klay Thompson has the ball, cannot get rid of his man. So he takes it, and whoa. That was very good defense by Reggie Jackson with a very soft touch by Klay Thompson. And you guys are seeing now Curry decides to go off. Once one turns up, the other one turns up, and then the other one turns up. They have five players that can turn up, and this is going to be a problem. Wide open Curry. I stepped off because I thought I was supposed to get the other guy. I thought we were switching. Bad communication, and because of that, they're on a 13-3 to run. To the rack, I go another dunk. But right now, it's not looking good at all. 37-23 to 23 is the score. And uh, about 20 seconds left in the second quarter. Blake Griffin with the ball. Posting up. To the rack, he goes. And what a finish. Blake Griffin using his athletic ability to get that bucket. Now, you guys are seeing it's halftime. And it's time to go over some stats right here. 37-25 to 25 is the score. And the Warriors are shooting 55%. Basically, every other shot. Actually, not basically. Every other shot they take, they're making. And you guys have seen the player to half. And who else, man? Who else? Kevin Durant. I have to play better defense on him. And oh, what a spin move right there. But he has been turning up and doing his thing. At half, he has 14 points shooting. 6, 4, 13. All right. Second half. Third quarter it is. You cannot guard me, my guy. He can guard me. That's why I had to give it up. But I'm going right back at Andre Iguodala. Now, for some reason, KD did not start the second half. I don't know why. I don't know if he's hurt or not. But you guys did see Drummond with the hook shot. Once again to the basket, I go in. I'm going to go some post work right here. Spin move. Reverse layup. And that's how we do it. That's how you turn up. That's how you play ball. And I could take it inside or outside. I could shoot threes. I could dunk layup. Post work, it does not matter. Now, Curry is taking his own sweet time. You guys are seeing. To the rack, he goes once again. And a jump shot. But Draymond Green is there to tip that back in with a dunk. And a very good job. Now, Curry with a pull-up three. And, okay, pull-up two. But why is this happening to us? Why are we letting them turn up? Curry again. Oh, what a cut by KD. And I fell asleep on defense there. I need to work on locking up on D. It doesn't matter if I score 50 points a game, if we're scoring, or if the other team is scoring more than us, we're going to lose. I got to lock up at all times. But you guys are seeing, oh my, the handoff and the curl, the three, it drops. The two and it drops. This man Curry is taking deep two-point shots today, but a very good job. Now, you guys are seeing we're down by 20, and I got to figure something out. So I'm like, all right, let's do a pick and roll. Blake Griffin picks, or I pick, and then I roll. And then I take an uh, elbow jumper, and that is good. 17 points so far today. Let's go again. I'm getting locked up. I want another pick and roll. This time I'm going to pick right here. I'm going to roll out to the three-point line. And a three ball is good. Knockdown, you guys are seeing. I can do it all. And that also does complete an objective uh, for me, which was to make one three-pointer today. So I get an extra XP for that, which is good. Now, we're still down by 20, and this game is over, y'all. This, oh, good block. This game, see, oh, my ankles got cracked, but I'm there. And a good block again. A three ball, and oh, my. Two blocks by Drummond. I got my ankles crossed, but I recovered, played great defense, Curry gets the ball and drops a three. I mean, this is just, this is terrible, man. What can we do? We're trying everything, but nothing seems to work. I'm going to give the ball down to post to Drummond right here. Well, to Calaron, but now I'm going to give it to Drummond. And then a steal. Curry with the steal. This game is over. We're going to end up losing by 21 points, 71 to 50. And we're going to have to find a way to step up. We're going to have to find a way to put the ball in the basket more. We're going to have to find a way to play better defense because I cannot be losing 20 by 21 points. We were 3-0 this season. It looked like we were going to run the table, but 
of course we go against the best team in the league and what happens they beat us by 21 if we're gonna want to win the championship i guarantee we're gonna have to go through um golden state so with that being said we're gonna have to find a way to beat them three point shooting was the game track of the day and you guys are seeing curry doing fadeaways doing all sorts of three pointers and he had himself a very very good day now you guys have seen off the missed free throw cousins clay three ball they can do it in transition they could do a spot up they could do it on the run they could do it on the move it does not matter you guys are seeing they went seven for 16 from three today which is a very high percentage all right play of the game or player of the game is steph curry and steph curry had himself a very good game now the player of the game you guys are seeing right here you already know who it is Steph Curry the man was making difficult shots all day and I mean for him difficult shots are easy shots so he was just making normal shots crossing players over dropping threes dropping uh, floaters all that kind of stuff the man did have 18 point shots five for eight for twos and two for six for threes I believe it said now Drummond you guys are seeing right here had eight points Blake Griffin had 12, and I had 20 points with a block, four assists, and two rebounds. So I played pretty well. Need to up my scoring, but Drummond also needs to up his scoring, and so does Blake Griffin, and also their rebounding is uh, not good enough. Now, you guys are seeing Reggie Jackson, our point guard, our starting point guard, who wants to be a star in this league. No points, no assists, no steals, no blocks, no rebounds, and he wants to be a starter. He played 20 minutes. And he had no stats at all. That is unacceptable. That can't be happening. Now you guys are seeing KD with 16, Curry with 18, Clay with 10, Draymond with 10, Cousins with 5. Their whole starting lineup played well. Even um, Sean Livingston had 5 points, 4 assists, and 2 rebounds. So Jackson does nothing. Even their backup point guard does better than our starter. That is unacceptable. Now we did get 2 skill points in this game right here as you guys are seeing. And I will be applying those to the three-point shooting and the dunking. I need to improve my dribbling layup and mid-range, but I really want to max out my dunking and three-pointers right now and then work on the layup and the mid-range later. Now, you guys are going to be seeing me equip the new Paul George jump shot. Hopefully, this works out for me. And also, I'm going to equip the new um, dunk, which is Terrence Ross's dunk package. Now, it's basically like Zach Levine's high-flying under the legs, all that stuff, spin moves. 360 so windmills you see it all so we're gonna apply that and hopefully we can get some posterizers in the next game because it's about time that we start dunking on people and uh showing out in the league what's going on folks it is case fade the prospect back with more highlights from the one did you see the rim rocking going on last night if you didn't i got you let's look at these highlights i don't know if the basket can come down I guess it can, because if it could, it would have went down last night. The one was attacking the basket all night. Okay, folks, in this case, made the prospect signing off. As you can see, the one lived at the rim last night. Nobody can do anything about it. And I'll be here with more highlights from the one in the future. Make sure you come back. You guys saw my boy K Spade talking some good words about me, saying how I've been turning up. I'm a rim rattler, and I'm getting above the rim and dunking the ball hard. So I got to continue doing that. And also, you know what I'm saying, changing my game up, going to post a little bit, take some jump shots from the twos and the threes. But I hope you guys enjoyed, man. If you guys did, smash that thumbs up and let me know what you think down below. How many games you want to see in the next episode? I'm thinking about two or three games, maybe even four games. I want to move this forward closer to the All-Star break and all that stuff so you guys can see, you know, awards and all that good stuff. But I hope you guys are enjoying. Stay tuned for any more coming out soon. And I'll see y'all later. I am out.